Hey, it's Mark Edward Lewis, and welcome back to Cinema Sound Studio B. If you've spent any time at all in the amazing essential sound panel in Adobe Audition, then you've probably noticed some of the new cool things that have been added there, none of the least of which is the auto-ducking feature. And, of course, you know how much I hate ducks. But this has nothing to do with animals. It has to do with ducking, and that is where, say, for example, you have a dialogue track and music. You may want to duck or reduce the sound of the music whenever the dialogue comes in and do it in a really nice and easy way. Well, this does this for you automatically. It's amazing. It's more Adobe Audition voodoo. Let me show you how to do it. Hey, we're here in Adobe Audition with the Essential Sound panel here brought on the right. We do that by going to Window and selecting Essential Sound, and there it will show up. We're here in a pretty simple mix. There's just some dialogue with a little music, and we want to see if we can automatically duck that music down and uh, while the dialogue's speaking. So let's take a listen here to what we have. I would say with the success of Wonder Woman, everyone can agree that be able to, to be leads and have a great movie and men and women of all ages come and watch and enjoy it. Uh, I say it's very important and I still feel like there's... Now obviously the music is way the fat too loud and obviously we could pull the fader down on it too but let's really give Adobe Audition a hard time and see what, what it'll come up with automatically. Well, the first thing we need to do is tell Adobe Audition what dialogue files are and what music files are, which are which. These here in the white that's being selected, these are our dialogue files. And we can go them over here and you can see the various types that you can choose. We're gonna choose dialogue. And as soon as we do, we get all of these cool options available to us. But most importantly, if we look here, we see the audio type dialogue. That's these little circle things that are showing up here. If we were to say clear audio type, you'll notice that they go away. And we could call it music if we want, and we get the little musical notes. But in this case, we want it to be dialogue. Now we're gonna go to this little piece here. These are the two music tracks. Uh, in fact, I'm just gonna go like this and drag both of these. And I'm gonna call these music. And I get the music uh, parameters that are available here. And then the music little notey things happen here. Technical term, notey things. Together now, we can do auto-ducking. And you can see, once we have the music files selected, both of them, we can go to ducking. Once we click on it, it gives us all kinds of options, and it's starting to do its work here. Well, I just actually finished it. These little pink little things here show us that it has, in fact, done an essential sound panel reduction, except for this little place right here. And we'll wonder why that is in a second. But let's first just see how it did. Everyone can agree that um, it has really paved a way for women to be able to, to be leads and have a great movie. And men and women of all ages come and watch and enjoy it. Uh, I say it's very important. And I still feel like there's so much more that we... So much smarter on how it did this reduction. And of course, we can change this reduction in any way we want. We can call it 18 decibels or we can reduce it uh, far more if we like. And now it's reduced it by quite a bit more. Let's see what happens here now. Um, it has really paved a way for... Let's go later. And of all ages, come and watch and enjoy it. Uh, I say it's very important and I still feel like there's so much more that we can um, we can actually explore with that. Um, so that's obviously way, way down there. But let's see what happens with this little blip that's happening here. Character shows. And so it would be cool to see something of growth um, with Harley since the fans... So it found that there was a little bit of a space here and that's cool. But because she's talking this whole way through, it's very difficult for us to be able to tell what's really going on or how it's worked. So what we're going to do, take a little space, we're going to cut this, and then we're also going to tell it to mute. So now this part's muted, and as soon as I did that, you can see that it's already done a different curve. You don't know if you can see that, these little lines. And in fact, it's going to be really too much to keep continue having this at minus 30. So let's take it back to the 18 decibel setting that we had, and already it changes it. In fact, we're going to make this fade a whole second long, and it will change the fade. Let's see how this goes. Liked, but she was not a, she was not a good role model. Um, You're just going to mute feel this. Like there needs to be there needs to be maybe they talked about another film of Harley. Because 
that's an alt. And, you know, we haven't done any editing. This is just fooling around with settings. We can make this fade half a second. That might actually feel a little bit better. And notice all the other fades that start showing up in between dialogue bits. Liked, but she was not. A, she was not a good role model. Um, I feel like there needs to be. There needs to be. Maybe they talked about another film of Harley. And then obviously you can change the sensitivity to being very low sensitivity, where the dialogue really doesn't do much, or super high, where we get a much better choice in terms of how you know what when the dialogue comes in, how long will the gate stay open of keeping that music down? Let's just drop in a little bit later here. Maybe they talked about another film of Harley. So now you can see the music's coming up a little bit later. Let's kind of split the difference. It was at six. Let's call this a nine. See that fade. Actually, let's call it a little bit earlier. Somewhere here. Maybe they talked about another film of Harley. Because that's an all too. And I might make the split the difference with the fade to keep it three quarters of a second. Let's see. Maybe they talked about another film of Harley. Because that's an. So you can mess with these settings all you want. The only hard part about this is selecting the dialogue and then selecting the music. And you can use this as an auto ducking feature all day long in the Essential Sound Panel. Right? Total Adobe Audition Voodoo. Amazing. And that you can change how fast it goes up and down. It's so easy to use. And if you've been using the Adobe Audition auto ducking tool in the ESP panel, let us know on the Cinema Sound Forum or here on this blog. Until then, we'll see you in post. Even if you're